All right, so today we are gonna be going over some realistic Roblox games because we haven't done it in a while. But unlike the other videos, this video is gonna solely focus on the realism instead of like FPSs or a certain genre of game. We're gonna do anything and everything. So let's just jump right into it because I have some really awesome games to show off. Our first game here is called Interval and the theme of the game is it's not a bug, it's a feature. And you'll see what I mean by that in a second. So when you get in the game, you can see that everything is frozen in time. And there's a lot of visual malfunctions, quote unquote, right? But the entire point of the game is one, it's a showcase. And two, it's to go past these obstacles through advancing time. So if you press E to advance time, as you see, time passes. You can even reset the time by pressing Q. And all you gotta do is basically go through the obstacles here when you're passing time. If I can actually get up on this thing. Huh, got it. And just like that, you are through. And then if you want to reset time, you can do that. And then you can just hop on up. Now, in terms of visuals, this game is pretty sick. It actually won a Bloxy Award for having the best immersion in your environment. In 2021, I'm pretty sure. So, this game won a Bloxy. It deserves its spot. Let's go ahead and move on to the next game. Now this next game is pretty stunning. As you see, this is Roblox, and this might be the most realistic Roblox game I've ever seen in my entire life. Now this game is really just a demo, and it's called The Canyon, and basically you're in this car and you just drive around. Honestly, it is so cool. Um, the steering's absolutely terrible in this game, but the graphics are cool. I mean, just look at this. This game is absolutely sick. I mean, name another Roblox game that has these kind of realistic cars that's free to play. I can just imagine that this is what the next GTA 6 will look like. <laughs> but a thing I've noticed is that playing this is really hard because the graphics are almost too good for Roblox and your computer has a pretty hard time trying to keep up with it. But is it a cool game just to kind of show your friends and look around? Yeah, it is. This game has better graphics than most triple-A games. It's crazy. <laughs> and then some kid put in the chat, my mom told me she would buy me Forza Horizon. Oh my god, that is actually hilarious. That's not even scripted. Shout out to this guy, Dude1K. Oh, how funny. But yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the next game. Now, this game is probably one of the best games on Roblox I've ever seen, period. But this one is called Tunneler, and it's Portal 2 inside Roblox. And it has better graphics than Portal itself. And another cool thing about this game is not only is it extremely realistic, it's actually playable, and there's a bunch of levels you can do right now. I've already made a video on this before, so I highly recommend you check it out, but this game is absolutely insane and extremely impressive for the Roblox engine. I can't imagine how somebody codes this, let alone puts it into Roblox. Absolutely insane. Let's go on to our next game. So our next game that we have here is a showcase game and it actually also won a Bloxy, I'm pretty sure, for like some of the best graphics in Roblox, but this is Paris. But it's like eye candy. It's really nice to look at. You know, it, you can just appreciate the art that went into this. I mean, just look at the Eiffel Tower. Isn't that so nice? And the shadows are also done extremely well in this game too. And the lighting is just phenomenal. Now, there's not really much you can do in this game because it really is just trying to show off the realistic graphics, but it's a nice look. So I guess that answers the question on who's in Paris. And so that wraps up today's video. Now, I've been pre-recording all of these videos for the past few days just because there's a massive hurricane about to hit me, but by the time this video is already up, I'll probably already be dead. So, please use Starcode Corny to uh, avenge my um, death against this hurricane. Bye-bye!